Hi everyone, my name is Nasir and I'm from Science Centre Singapore and you are watching Science What? Now picture this, the Golden Gate Bridge, the Sydney Harbour Bridge and one of our local iconic bridges, the Henderson Wave Bridge. Have you ever marveled at these majestical structures? In today's episode, we are going to be exploring more on bridges. Bridges are structures built over water or roads to allow people to get from one place to another. We probably use bridges more often than we think. We use overhead bridges to cross the road. Vehicles use them over the expressways to get from one area to another. These bridges are usually well supported by beams or cables as they have to withstand a huge amount of weight. But have you ever heard of a self-supporting bridge? Tada! Introducing Leonardo da Vinci's self-supporting bridge. This ingenious bridge design was designed by da Vinci in the late 14th to 15th century. He created this bridge in order to allow military troops to quickly cross bodies of water and obstacles. Let's take a closer look at the intricate design of this bridge over here. Da Vinci's bridge consists of these wooden locks with grooves which allows them to be easily assembled to form this amazing arch bridge over here. But there's something special about this bridge. If you look closely, there are no nails, screws or ropes in this structure. It is in fact being supported by friction and its own weight, hence its name, the self-supporting bridge. But how is the bridge able to support its own weight? When any load is applied on the bridge, or in this case, a human walking on the bridge, the force from the load spreads across the entire arch, causing the wooden structure to interlock tightly. As the beams bend, the rigidity of the beams create the stability to allow one to cross safely across the bridge. And just as the bridge can be quickly assembled, it can also be disassembled easily. Removing just a single piece of wood would cause the bridge to collapse. Amazing, isn't it? How about we build our own Da Vinci self-supporting bridge at home? Let's try it out. We will only need these large popsicle sticks. Let's begin. First, we arrange the sticks as such. Two sticks at the sides, one above and one below. And then we repeat. Put another stick below and gently lift up the structure to insert the two sticks at the side. Can you see the arch bridge slowly taking shape? You can continue with the same arrangements to build up the length of the bridge. Try building the longest bridge that you can. Or see how much weight your bridge can take. And that's how you make science come alive. Thank you for watching our video. If you want to learn more about Leonardo da Vinci's inventions, do come down to Da Vinci the Exhibition, which will be happening at Science Centre Singapore until 2nd January 2022. If you've enjoyed watching our video, please like and share this video with your family and friends. Don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon to be the first to watch our new videos. Goodbye!